Today we're going to be performing an oil solubility test. Anytime you're working with a product that is a water soluble oil, one of the controls you need to do to determine the titration would be to do an acid split test. So for that test, we're going to take a determined volume of the sample solution. We're going to be using a graduated cylinder. We're going to measure out 90 mils. So once we have the exact measurement of the solution that we're going to be testing on, we're then going to take 10 mils of a concentrated hydrochloric acid and we're going to spike the solution. And we're going to just double check, make sure that our total volume is up to 100 mils. And we're good. And then you're going to use the stopper, place it on top of the cylinder, and then you're going to invert it several times to make sure that that acid is thoroughly mixed within that solution. Then you can remove the stopper. Now you'll allow the solution to settle and the split to happen. So once you've allowed your solution to fully split out, you'll then take the volume of the oil layer that is at the top of the cylinder and divide it by the initial volume of the sample that you initially put into the solution. And then that ratio will help you determine the effective concentration of your product and solution.